and good day. My name is Jürgen Steinmetz from eTurbo News, and this is a breaking news update. For more news updates and shows, please go to youtube.com slash travel news group, youtube.com slash travel news group. Here's our update. Jamaica Tourism Minister speaking now at the Anchor Awards. Jamaica Tourism Minister, Hun Edmund Bartlett, is scheduled to speak later today at the American Caribbean Maritime Foundation's Anchor Awards, taking place at the Fort Lauderdale Yacht Club in Florida. One of the honorees was a pillar in Jamaica's tourism and shipping industries, Mr. Harriet Mara. Also being honored is the Senior VP of Technology and Operational Excellence of Tote Maritime, Ms. Elise Lisk. The Bahamas Prime Minister and Deputy Prime Minister will be in attendance along with the Minister of Tourism and Investment for Antigua and Barbuda. The event will be chaired by Mike Mora, CEO of the Nassau Cruise Port Limited, and will honor Mr. Harriet Mara, CEO, Lanneman and Morris, Shipping, Limited Posthumous, and Ms. Elise Lisk, Senior Vice President of Technology and Operational Excellence, Tote Maritime. I am very pleased to be attending and delivering remarks at this year's Anchor Awards. It is especially heartening to share my gratitude to the family of our very own Harry Mara, who was a pillar in Jamaica's tourism and shipping industries. His contribution was truly invaluable and he was indeed a remarkable human being, said Jamaica Tourism Minister Bartlett. I am also looking forward to congratulating Ms. Elise Lisk, who is also being honored this evening for her contribution to the maritime industry, as well as the foundation for all the important work they do to assist Caribbean students, added Bartlett. The Anchor Awards will be attended by several government officials and senior executives of major cruise and cargo liners. Government officials expected to attend include Bahamian Prime Minister The Most Hun, Philip Davis, Deputy Prime Minister of the Bahamas, Hun Chester Cooper, Minister of Tourism and Investment for Antigua and Barbuda, Hun Charles Fernandez. Also expected to attend are, Rick Sasso, CEO of MSC Cruises, Michael Bailey, CEO of Royal Caribbean International, and Rick Morrill, CEO of Saltchuck, parent company of Tropical Shipping. The American Caribbean Maritime Foundation is a non-profit organization based in New York, the U.S., supporting Caribbean students studying maritime. The foundation exists to specifically support the work of the Caribbean Maritime University, Jamaica, the University of Trinidad and Tobago, and LJM Maritime Academy, Bahamas. It provides scholarships to Caribbean nationals who are aspiring seafarers to study maritime-related coursework and degrees, funds the building of classrooms, provides laptops to support remote study. The foundation has also awarded 61 scholarships and grants to students from Jamaica, the Bahamas, Trinidad, Grenada, St. Vincent and the Grenadines, and St. Lucia. Thank you for listening to our news update. There's more on youtube.com slash travel news group, or you can read us, of course, in going to our news portal at etrobonews.com or travelnews.online.